Hello everybody. We wanted to show students one of the neat new features available in Google Chrome OS on their Chromebooks. Right now when you click on the app launcher in the lower left corner of the screen you see the pages of apps that we've deployed. And the apps are really in any order that Google throws them out in uh, beyond Chrome and the Google Store, Google Search always appearing somewhere near the top, um, usually near the top left corner. So we've got pages of apps and we're likely to have more over time and they're not really well organized. Well, like mobile devices, uh, Google has allowed apps to be placed into folders now to keep them more organized. So I want to show you how to do that and give you some examples of folders you might want to create. So for example, I want Google Drive and all of my Google Drive apps to be in a folder together. So I'm going to take Google Docs and I'm just going to drag it it lets me right on top of Google Drive and you can see that can take some trial and error there and now it's put Drive and Docs in the same folder it's this round circle I'm going to take Google Sheets and drag it and eventually I win it's a little bit of a game take Google Slides and I win now I here it is I wanted to find Google Drawing I'm going to take Google Drawing from this page and slide it over to the left and it'll bring me the front page and there we go and there's only room to see the first four applications in that folder but when I open the folder I can see all five so again here on the main app screen I can only see the first four but when I open it I can see all five and I want to give this folder a name Google Drive Apps And that name's kind of long, so I'm going to shorten it, actually. Let's open it again. Click here. Drive apps. There we go. So I have other apps. Now I can also move my apps around. So I want Classroom to be right up here. And the Chrome Store. Students can't do much with it. I want that to go to the next page. There it goes. That can go at the end. Uh, here I have Lucid Chart and Lucid Press. I'm going to put those in a folder together. And I'm going to click on that to name the folder. I'm going to call it Lucid. And I can hit the back arrow. And now if I want to drag that folder to the front page, there we go. I can come back here and put Wii Video next and Wii Video. And watch this. I want to take Twisted Wave, my audio recording app and put it in that same folder media creation is what I'm going to call that because that's where I create videos and audio so there we can see I can build all of my apps like that uh, move them around get help I don't need that I know how to work Chromebook pretty well so we'll put that on page two snag it let's go put that on media creation it's a pretty good one. Up, oh, where's my media creation folder? It's still on the second page. So here we go. I can just drag these guys and move them around. Same with Pixlr TouchUp, my photo editing app. There it is. And let's go get my camera app while I'm at it and put it in there. So I can do a bunch of things here. I can move apps into my folders. And one of the things you'll notice is I used to have three bars down here at the bottom of the screen. Now I only have two. And again, I can move these around as much as I want. I want all of my math apps in a math folder together, including my calculators, because I don't usually use my calculators because I just use the Google bar. Here we go. We'll move GeoGebra, Numerics. And we'll name this math. I want my calendar. Let's. I thought I took get help out of there. Can we move that one? Here we go. Let's see if we can put that down by the store. And we did. Oh, look, my Google Forms is here. That should be in my Google Drive folder. So I'm just going to take it, move it right over there, and look at how full that folder is. Drive apps. And I can see it says Drive Apps, all nice and neat. Now here I have my Gmail. I also have my Gmail offline. 
I can just maybe see it's a little bit of a game. Well, ah, I won, and I'm gonna name this folder Gmail. There we go. So that's all there is. You can drag things around. I want Google Keep right up here. Google Search. No, I use Chrome for that, so I can move that back. Um, Weather Channel I want on my front page. And again, you can just move stuff around. Chrome Remote Desktop. We don't really use that. So there we go. Get that out of there. And I can probably have this down to one page of apps if I wanted to. That's really not the goal. And uh, But it, it does give me a lot of options for reorganizing my app structure and making it quicker and easier for me to get to my apps. So there you go. Some tips on putting your apps into folders and also organizing them. Hope you like this. And... Have a great year using your Chromebooks and all these apps.